Yeah, I'm Casting Nerd and I am wet. Take it easy, man. That was lewd. <laughs> what is up, nerds? So today I am in my car. It is uh, it is a wonderful Thursday evening or no, not evening afternoon. It's only about two twenty right now for me in uh, Chicago land. And just like any good day in Chicago land, it's wet and. It's you know, when I get back next month, I'm going to buy myself a proper DSLR and screw this whole cell phone thing. Anyways, um, <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I don't know if this video is going to go up before I explain why I'm going to be gone for a month. You will have videos, trust me. I'm going to be recording a month's worth of video all at once, so that's going to be an adventure and a half. But yeah, anyway, so as you see, I am once again in my car with some cool stuff, which you may have already be know about. I don't know. It just depends on where you are. It depends on when I open this. But anyway, so I am out in, um, well, I'm out and about and I'm working again. And I, um, some of you might have not been following me on Twitter. Remember that I, uh, I encountered a cigar store with packs of Pokemon cards. Like it was like the most surreal thing in the world. I walked in looked over and then there's just this wall with trading cards i mean it wasn't just pokemon it was magic gathering Yu Gi Oh, all that good stuff and they had piles of them they even had like japanese ones and everything uh not with the pokemon though anyway so i went and checked out the cards and it wasn't like just like newer stuff the newest set they had was furious fists and that's uh, you know that's a set that's getting a little bit older primarily what they had here was black and white packs which, as you can see, I went and I bought a stack. I got like 20 different black and white packs. I can't remember exactly. Let me count this out for you guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. That's 17 packs. Yeah, 17 packs of cards I bought. Uh, I also got two tins, two older tins. I got myself a Greninja. You know, let me turn off my, um. I should probably turn that off. Um. That was probably bothering you guys, wasn't it? All right, you know, let me turn the car off entirely. There we go. I apologize. Uh, I got a Greninja tin, and I also got this Delphox tin. To see it a little pricey, but these are kind of hard. I think these go for quite a bit more than $23 on eBay right now. I'm not 100%, but they're a little bit harder to find. Um, these are older. I think these were from uh, when X-Way first came out. These are from 2014, so I think these might have X-Way base. They might have some... Uh, black and white in them as well. Maybe I'll get some more legendary treasures. But the big prize, I didn't even know I got this pack in there, was I, I almost thought it was like a Next Destiny's pack or something like that. But it, I, when I was sorting through my packs and I went open and I found a heart silver, um, you know, undaunted pack. This is, you know, I mean, this won't be the oldest, oldest pack I opened. I opened a jungle pack. But since I only got one of these, every other one of those, I got like three or four packs each of the different different ones so those will be good for their own videos but i wanted to do a quick unpacking video of you know since i only got one pack of this i'm going to do a car vlog telling you what i got here and opening up this uh heart silver soul silver, uh heart silver undaunted okay it's a tr uh, tongue twister okay uh let's see there is the back by the way if you guys want to read the back Apparently you can get something called Legend Cards in here. I'm not familiar with the Heart Silver sets at all. I haven't opened any of these ever. It's not like some of those old vintage packs I opened, I opened back in the day. This is completely new to me, even though it is fairly old. It is from 2010. This is a seven-year-old pack, and I only got it. Yeah, I paid up $4.29. I paid over-the-counter price. I looked them up on eBay, and they were going anywhere from $7 to $10 a pack. So I got this for a pretty decent price. And I'm almost, um, I'm kind of holding back. I'm trying to, should I open this? Yes, I'm going to open this. I can't wait. These don't come with code cards, sadly. This is before I think they started that with the black and white sets. But yeah, all right, let's see what we get in here. I'm not sure what the if there's a different pack trick in these, so I'm just gonna do three to the front. Hopefully we get a good pull out of this. You know, it's our only one. It'd be nice if we got something decent out of it. And it's gonna be one of those where the... Okay, I'm kinda, oh, I might be able to preserve the pack, actually. Ooh. Ooh. So yeah, these. <coughs> All right, sudden coffee fit. Either way, 
So we're going to just do this uh, three to the front, two and three. Ooh, these actually feel a little bit thick. They feel a little different. Maybe were they better quality back then? I don't know. So either way, oh, I mean, the design of the packs are a little bit different too here. So let's start. We have ourselves a unknown. And we're just going to do this one at a time. Uh, muck. Oh, I need a better way to do these. I'll figure it out eventually. Uh, Slowbro. Very cool. And uh, these are just the uncommons. These are really neat looking. I mean, these are so different than what I'm used to, even like some of the older stuff. And, wow. Uh, if you guys like this, I might uh, look about picking up some more of these um, heart silver sets. I can definitely try. I know for some of you, you might be a little more nostalgic for this stuff. I'm uh, mischievous, by the way, than uh, <laughs> for the um, real old vintage stuff. Because I know a lot of you are younger, so these are probably closer to the stuff that you got when you were kids. And we got ourselves a Doe Duo. Very nice. I like it quite a bit. Ooh. And I like how it's got like, there's like three different, or three or four different colors in there. I don't know if you can see that. That's really neat, actually. I like that. I like the designs of these quite a bit. So we got ourselves a pine goat and a Eevee. I don't know if they did reverses in this set. Uh, if we do get a reverse, it's going to be this next. <gasps> oh my God! What the? Is that a reverse in this set? They got a Hound Doom, but look at that. It's got like gold full text, kind of a silver border. What is that? I don't even know what this is. Wow, that's really neat. And I don't know. Um, I'm going to have to ask ask the guys what this is. Oh my god, that is cool. And our rare is just a... As I skarmory, is our rare. That is pretty neat. I don't know what this is. I'm going to have to... Wow, oh, this is really cool. Oh man, so whatever this is, if this is a reverse, this is like the coolest reverses ever, but... Maybe something else? Yeah, it, it, maybe it have to because like the border is, oh man, I, wow, okay, I know I'm getting a little weird. So anyone let me know, if, is this how they did reverses back then or if I'm, I don't know. Very cool. I'm actually quite happy. It's a rare, so worst case scenario, I ended up with a reverse rare here. Wow, okay. Anyways, nerds, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. I certainly did. That was a really cool, cool thing to get. And um, yeah, I hope you guys have an amazing day. No, don't get wet. Because you don't want freaking soaked, shaggy DA hair going on. No, it's not cool. All right? Talk to you guys later. Bye.